Okay, next up, we'd like to find a polynomial of degree 3 with the following zeros. So it's of degree 3, and he has three zeros, so they're all to the power of 1. And so for x is equal to 0, this simply means x is quite literally equal to 0. For x is equal to negative 5, that corresponds to x plus 5 is equal to 0. And for x is equal to 3, that corresponds to x minus 3 is equal to 0. And so when we put that all together, we get x times x plus 5 by x minus 3 is equal to 0 is our polynomial. So for the zeros, we know that this equation will be satisfied if x is 0, if x is negative 5, or if x is 3, which means that it is our f of x. And then we just expand that out. So if you x by x, x by 5, you get x squared plus 5 by x minus 3 is equal to f of x. Next up, we would like to do x squared by x, x squared by negative 3, 5 by x, 5 by negative 3. That is x cubed minus 3x squared plus 5x minus 15 is equal to 0. Sorry, is equal to f of x. And this is going to be our final answer. You can leave it in factored form as this, or if you'd like to prove that it, it is of degree 3, you can expand it out like that.